back to Cooking with Josh. And Babe. And Babe. Today is a special anniversary edition video. Babe, I asked Babe to be my girlfriend three years ago today. <laughs> and how great is she and how lucky am I? I said, Babe, do you want me to take you out to a nice dinner? What, you know, what do you want to do for our anniversary? She said, why don't we make a really nice steak at home and, and have a pajama party? We'll have a pajama party and we'll watch a movie. We'll drink some good wine. We'll make an awesome steak. We'll make a side dish and that'll be our anniversary at home. Yeah. I love you, babe. I love you too. <laughs> so today we're going to show you how we make a three pound. For our three years. For our three years, three pound. Actually, it's actually like three and a half pounds. Three and a half pounds for three year anniversary. And how much weight I've gained. 35 pounds. <laughs> I think since we started YouTube. No, babe, no. Yeah. Tomahawk ribeye steak. This is a massive, massive monster of a steak. Yeah. Our side dish is going to be bacon wrapped asparagus, which we're also going to do on the Weber kettle, low and slow. This is going to be a low and slow cook. Tomahawk ribeye steak, uh, some bacon wrapped asparagus, some really good wine. And this happens to be our video to enter into the cooking collaboration. Hashtag ribs and a side. And you might be saying Josh and babe. <laughs> But you have to do ribs and a side. Well, what's in a tomahawk steak? A giant rib. So that makes it ribs. Okay, Corey? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Corey. But, yeah, Corey. <laughs> This collaboration was started by another fellow YouTuber called Cooking with Corey. Check out his channel. And everybody's uh, putting together their best rib dish and their best side dish. Well, all. Well, all. What? <laughs> well, our entry. <laughs> <laughs> is this tomahawk ribeye rib steak and bacon wrapped asparagus? Yeah, babe. I love and you. our three year anniversary. And our three year anniversary. That's our. <laughs> I love you, babe. That's what we're doing. <laughs> and I'm happy to have this pajama party at home with you. Yeah. So, without further ado, let's get into the cook and it's gonna be awesome. Ready? Yep. So, here we go! <laughs> There we are, back again. All right, so let me just give you a quick rundown of how we're gonna cook this tomahawk. Uh, we're gonna get our Weber kettle. We're gonna do about 25 briquettes. We're gonna get the, the kettle to about 200 to 225 internal. We're gonna cook this thing low and slow. We're gonna bring it up to about 80 degrees. We're gonna flip it. We're gonna bring it up to about 115, 120. We're gonna load the charcoal up super hot. We're gonna do a reverse sear, one minute, one minute, one minute, one minute. We're gonna let it rest. Hopefully that brings it up into the, uh, 135, 140 neighborhood for a medium rare, medium-ish. That's how, that's how we like it. Look at this. So I put the thermometer into the biggest, meatiest part. I mean, look at how thick this thing is. Oh, this yeah. is massive. So our kettle right now is at 220. Okay. So let's pull this off. Right like this. Like a big beefy, big beefcake. <laughs> Big beefcake, babe. Yeah, like you, babe. Yeah. You're my big beefcake. Yeah, babe. Pajama party, babe. Pajama party. Yeah, babe. All right, babe. Let's talk about the wine first. Well, uh, my client got it for me for, well, she brought it from their cellar for Christmas. They have this incredible wine cellar at their home. And so she brought this. It's a Fontanella 2010 cab. Let me get a good zoom in on that. You can only imagine. It's very delicious. So that's gonna be the wine with our uh, mm -hmm. delicious steak. Yeah. All right, so we had an agreement. No cards, no anniversary presents. I show up at home today from work and there's a card sitting on the table. So babe violated the agreement. But little did she know, I also violated the agreement and I got her a little tiny baby present. <laughs> And, and she claims that she knows what it is. I so know. I had her send me an email. She, the email has been sent saying that she knew what it is before she even saw the box or anything. I know. So then I went out to my car, I got the box, I made babe put a, a cover <laughs> over her head. And now we're gonna have babe open the present. Okay, and, I know uh, what it is. And then, yeah, so Are we'll see. 
Are you gonna read what I think it is first? My, I think my <laughs> present is going to be giant champagne glasses. <laughs> Better be a bottle with them. That's what Babe emailed me. The big ones that we the saw. The big champagne, dude, there are these really cool <laughs> big is. champagne glasses. I think that's what oh. it is. Oh, good, oh, good. Now, hold on, let me flip the camera around. Okay. Okay, babe, okay. Look, open your big giant champagne Very glasses. Heavy. Look at this V. Yeah. Babe, what? I didn't get you a card because I stuck to our agreement. Is it a Keurig? Yeah, it's a Keurig. Uh, why is it so heavy? I don't know. <laughs> oh, no, you didn't. No, you didn't. No way. How did you do that? Did you really? He said it was for me, for our apartment. Oh, just look. It's a blender. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I mean, I didn't want to act thrown or anything, but inside I was. I mean, I thought something for the apartment, maybe, maybe a new clock or a cool phone or a great art book or something, but a blender? I mean, what is this, 1958, to give the little wife a blender? I mean, it scared me, you know? Babe, you suck. <laughs> That's what I get for giving you an anniversary present? Are you kidding me? Isn't that what you asked for? Babe! Why did you do that? Isn't that what you asked for? No! I just said we wanted one! Babe! You said new year, new me. Babe! <laughs> and you wanted to make smoothies. Are you serious? No, you didn't. So, admit right now that you were wrong. I was wrong. Babe. <laughs> and tell me that you love me. Well, I love you. <laughs> How did you get that? Babe, hey, these I are you. expensive. Love you, babe. Mm -hmm. Babe. Yeah, babe, yeah. Why? Okay, happy anniversary. Back to the cooking. Thank See. you. All right, Corey, this is our side dish. Just uh, cut up a little uh, asparagus. Wrapped it with a little bit of bacon. I'm gonna wrap it in that tin foil. I'm gonna throw it on the kettle as well uh, with the tomahawk. So the tomahawk just hit 105 internal. I'm gonna go light an entire new chimney full of charcoal because I'm gonna I'm in preparation to get the Weber like super super hot. As soon as I'm just so excited about the blender. Um, as soon as the tomahawk gets to about 115 120, I'm gonna pull it off. We're gonna dry it off olive oil it a little bit, cracked ground pepper. I'm gonna get that Weber piping hot and then we're gonna do the reverse sear. We're almost done. We're, 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 we're getting there. It's been a little bit longer. We've kept the kettle at like 200 the whole time. So it's really, this is gonna be, this is gonna be epic. So, all right, let me go get the kettle ready and then we'll bring you right back. We're about ready to do the reverse sear and then you show up, sir. Like, can we talk about it? Like, no, there's not enough tomahawk for you. What, 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 what are you, what, what are you doing? No, no, no. What? And they are done. They're done with brownies? Perfect. Brownies? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Start the timer. One minute. We're gonna do a lot of searing on this right now. We're gonna get this hot and spicy. Oh, babe, I just pulled it off the barbecue. Let's talk about it. Oh, babe, do you want me to cut it? No, not yet. It has to rest. I'm so excited. That's nice. Oh, that looks very medium rare, which we love. Oh my gosh, it looks perfect. 
Look at the juice though. Oh babe, that is perfect. A lot of people are gonna say that it's like overcooked, but look at the juice. Overcooked, I mean, that's perfect for us. This is beautiful. Nice job, babe. I'm very proud of you. That's good. You may not put a ring on it, but you know how to cook a steak. That's perfect, babe. Oh my gosh. Nice job, babe. That's good. Happy anniversary, babe. I love you. Hashtag ribs in the side. I can't believe you're putting barbecue sauce on, babe. The comments below are gonna be like, what is, holy moly. That is perfect. Babe, this has been like a 12 hour project of life. Mm. Mm-hmm. The flavor is fantastic. I can't eat that whole. That is so good. That's like a pound of steak. I wouldn't be eating that, but the flavor is to die for. Oh babe, that is a good steak. You did a great job. Do I get do I get Happy one anniversary? Do I get one more year now? Uh, six months. Six months! Oh, six months! Oh, okay. Maybe six months. All right, everybody. You, what do you think about this angle? Anyways, thank you. Thank you for all the support. Three years with my love, babe. And uh, thank you for inviting us to the collaboration. And that's it, babe, right? All right, see you guys later.